Today we're going to tell you how to get your client in the perfect place to do your anterior neck work. Hey there, I'm Mary Claire with the Center for Barefoot Massage and welcome to our YouTube channel. So today we we're talking about doing the supine work. If you learned it and you have phenomenal work that can be done in the pecs, the scalenes, even some occipital work, but you don't do it because you can't reach your client, then this video is for you. Maybe your table's a little bit too far away, maybe your legs are short, but we end up doing really weird things, and I know because I did this for a long time, where we either scoot forward on the stool and we don't have any support for our back, or we keep our back against the wall and bring our rear end forward so we can reach, and this is really bad body mechanics, and that's bad for your back too. So in today's Tuesday Toes Day tip, we're going to show you just how to get your client to scoot themselves up to the end of the table so that you can easily reach them and do that work that they are going to find phenomenal. You always want to make sure that your client is straight on the table, so if he's not, have him straighten out first. Now place your hand at the top of the table and have your client scoot up so that the top of his head touches your hand. If you have particularly short legs, you can ask him to scoot up even more so that the top of his head is hanging off the table. This will allow you to be able to reach the neck and the shoulders when you do your supine neck work. If you'd like to see any videos on any particular subject, make sure you leave a comment below. Hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe so that you can see all of our videos as soon as they come out. Thanks!